It's Chuck G, Chaz Gouldemon. And Chuck is such an exciting snowboarder to watch, too. He brings, he definitely brings some style to the game. Chaz Gouldemon ready to go, his first run. All right, here he is on course, off the toes. Nice front lip there. Coming out switch. Cap 2-7 on that half rainbow there. And coming in, switch into this first jump. Switch back nine. Nice stall in there, too. Double back rodeo there, uh. Uh, Chuck G. <laughs> Chuck G off the chicken coop. Cab one on, back three out. Front board coming out, switch. Coming in to this jump, switch. And oh, getting a little loose there, but uh, still having speed. For a nice back 10 there, smooth landing there. <laughs> By Chaz Goldemon. How about that double back rodeo? That was so sick. Double back, so smooth. Let's hear it for Chuck G right there. Chaz Goldemon, first run of two for him. And let's check in with the Chanel Sladek standing by with Chuck G. Chanel, take it away. I'm here at the bottom with none other than Chaz Goldemon, a favored rider for the U.S. team and a true standout. How does it feel? You just stomped your first run. Ow! Feeling pretty good. Man, I'm out of breath. This elevation is tough, but uh, <laughs> just having fun out there. It's a blessing to be here. Awesome. And uh, do we, you want to give us a little sneak peek of what we get to see next run, or is it a surprise? Um, maybe I'll step up the rails a little bit, but I'm just going to go out there and try to show some style. Well, you always bring style and you always bring smiles. Have fun out there. Back to you, boys. Yeah, Chuck G. Good to see you out here, man. Chuck G in his first run right there, waiting for that score to come in. What does Chaz Gouldemon mix in with the rest of the guys? And the score ran a 77-2. So just outside the 80s right there, and he'll be in second place for Chaz Gouldemont after his first run, a 77-2. This is Pay2 Piroinen. All right, dropping and switch here. Cab 2-7 oh, there. Oh, wow. Tech. Onto the uh, step down. Yeah, Pay2, 2010, silver medalist in, in pipe. So we got an Olympian on course here. And that's in pipe, just showing you There's he's a got big back 10. He's got skills in both. Yeah, he does. He was on our start sheet yesterday for pipe and uh, opting not to compete. Um, I'm assuming just to focus on slope here today. Nice front one on, switch back three out. Or sorry, that was uh, Cab, he is a goofy footer. And a uh, big front seven there out of pay two. Into the back 10 there. Pedro Peronin, yeah, once again, Olympian from yeah. 2010. Very skilled individual. A very, a very quiet guy, too. I mean, a guy just lets the snowboarding do the talking for him. It's time for this man from Canada, 21 years old, for Ride Snowboards in Oakley, Seb to Sebastian Tuton. All right, Goofy Footer dropping in. Oh, Seb almost taking out some branding there on the side. He's holding on to it, though. They'll take points off of that. Back 2-7, <laughs> gap into the back side of that. Half rainbow there, 2-7 out. Coming in, switch here. With nice big cab five. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> big back one, Japan. Yeah, that's what I like to see. Just lay it out. Half cab on, front three out. Or sorry, back three out. And uh, Seb coming in forward here. It's cranking a nice method. Yeah, I like that. Having Showing a good time. And uh, he's going to skip the last jump because he's in there. You know, <laughs> oh, nice. Like the hand drag. Yeah, and, and if you're wondering, if you're watching this at home on the web, he's just having fun. I mean, you're Sebastian Tutan. You're in third place. You're going to be in the finals on Sunday. Yep. There's no way you're not going to be in there. So. Why just take the pressure off? Go have some fun in your second run, and that's what Seb was doing right there. A lot of fun to watch. Right and there. There's that back <laughs> one Japan. So sick, huh? So sick. Kind of reminiscent of uh, 
Nico Nicholas Mueller there. Whoa, good comparison. Love watching that guy's backside spin Japan's first one, uh, not the first one, but just really has been showing those off. Yeah. Look at Seps, he's all smiles. Who cares about the 28-2 when you got an 86.2? Third place, good job, Seb. We'll see you in the finals. Coming up switch, Eric Willette. So he is a goofy footer, dropped in switch there. Yeah, Eric Willette, once again, this is his home turf. That he is out here shredding on. Nice cap board, 2-7 out. Coming in switch into this first jump. With the cap dub under. Set himself up forward for jump number two. And uh, again, I used to just see Eric and his brother when they'd get off school, and I'm like, who are these two kids just <laughs> slaying it out here? And it was pretty quick, I was uh, giving their names, and I was like, oh, the Willette brothers? Okay, sounds good. So much talent out of these guys. Coming in switching to jump number three. Switch back nine, set himself up forward for the final jump here. And there you go, Eric Willette put it down. Front dub 10. Front dub 10 for Eric Willette. I love to see him stop that. He's so good for him to do good out here in Breckridge. You know that's what he wants to do. Get on there, represent the U.S. And come Sochi. So Eric Willette doing his best out here. Two-run format. Check the replays of Willette here. The Breck Loke. Here's the bottom two features. And yeah, that's that switch back nine. Set himself up forward into the last jump. And watch this. The one, two, three full rotations and getting a nice dip on both of those. Yeah, and stopping that landing too. So let's see what the score. That's got to be a good score. It is 87.2. Second place for Eric Willette. Yeah, wipe the brow, bro. This is Sean White. Sean's going to be dropping in here. Of course, regular footer. 2-7 on, 2-7 out there. And yeah, Sean qualifying top spot yesterday in pipe. And now out here trying to get a good showing in slope, coming in switch. The switch back 10 there. Sean looking in good <laughs> form on this slope course. Over to Chicken Coop for White. Like it's a bit of a nose press the board side there. Set himself up forward into this first jump. And front seven, lots of sevens there on uh, jump number three. Into a nice back 10. And that's Sean White right there. Sean White coming back out there, spraying the crew. <laughs> and I like the dip he threw on the second half of that rotation. That was pretty darn awesome. And I like to see him on the... Uh, a little bit more technical up there, up top, than we saw him last year. So Sean White coming back, doing his thing in slope style. Sean's return to slope style. Good to have him back in here. Number one qualifier yesterday in pipe. Where is he going to end up out here? Pay two is the 83 score to beat. Check the replays of Sean right here. There's that switchback 10 there. And yeah, Sean uh, looking good uh, with his style there, holding on to his grabs. Nice 360 over the chicken coop. And like I said, on this third jump, a lot of these guys are just using it as a uh, setup, getting the front seven in on that. Lots of sevens on that jump, but then setting them up for this last one. And uh, yeah, grabbing mute on that, pulling that back. And then the arm in the air. So we'll see. Where does Sean White go on that with that score? That's going to be a good run. Look at this. A 93.2 into first place for Sean White. Wow. Number one qualifier yesterday in pipe. And uh, he, he looks like he hasn't missed any days in slope style at all.